could be a stressful, stressful decision. <laughs> so luckily we have the At Crave Newcastle girls here to tell us which ones we should be choosing. Jess and Mel, good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Well, Jess, you know I, I love uh, my coffee. Mel, you have a bit of a recommendation for a brand new coffee shop that's just opened in Katara. Sometimes the shopping mall, it's really hard to actually get a proper good coffee. So this is a bit exciting. What's new? Yes, it was, I think, pretty highly anticipated. Um, the Mr. Sister that just opened up at Katara. So I totally feel you there. I've, I've been shopping before and I'm like, I really want a good coffee, but don't really have anywhere to go. Um, so when this opened, I was really excited. So um, it's owned by Garth and his sister's sister. And, Who um, the hell's Garth? He used to own one penny black. Well, Wayne's well. Yeah. Wayne's well. <coughs> he's, so, he's like renowned for good coffee in Newcastle. Basically, yeah. knows what he's doing. Um, and it's totally lived up to the expectation that I had from enjoying one penny black. And the good thing about them is they have these, um, they have like got the treats from Hello Naomi, which is on King so Street. So good. And yep. if you haven't had one of their like biscuit cookie sandwiches. <laughs> you haven't like, lived. <laughs> you haven't lived. Yep. Yesterday I got a coffee and I thought I'll just get one of them. And then I got in the car and I couldn't help myself. I ate it straight away. So, so, but at this rate, you're going to be hired by At Cave Newcastle. So just you can't know more oh, than yes, the I girls. All right, all right. This is their <laughs> special day. Now, Jess, I had a challenge for you. I said the weather's warming up, apart from mm, today and yesterday, of course. But get me the best seafood in Newcastle. Where can I go? Where can I go? We discovered the best seafood at a place that you might not originally think to go, but West in New Lampton have really stepped up their game in regards to food, and and they've got some really quality. Um, restaurants there and some good food coming out of the place but we went to a restaurant called Lore. it's located on the second level of West in New Lambton you kind of lose yourself when you go there you don't feel like you're in a club anymore the restaurant itself is really beautiful out they have a seafood window where you can see all of the seafood that they're sourced from the markets on display so you can pick what wow. you want to get and then the chefs cook it up for you it's, That's good. it's really cool. How about prices? Because sometimes seafood, you want to get it, but it's always so exy. Yeah, you've got to yeah. have parents, so they pay. That's true. <laughs> That's true. It's $55 a head for that, and you get every seafood you can think of. Such a generous so size. special occasion kind of stuff, though, still. Like, I mean, that's to me, that's a birthday. Oh, you I know, think... It's not an every week kind of it thing. It definitely looks like something you'd go to on on for a treat and a special occasion, mm. but, but still, I mean, really for money, we had four other sides to go with it, plus wine and the seafood platter, and we didn't and walk away with... Platter to the Pokey room? Oh, <laughs> we were going to slap a pokey after, but we didn't end up doing it. Definitely <laughs> Yeah. Dish of the week. Um, the dish of the week also actually comes from Lua. We had to talk about it, so we had a dessert there that was not seafood related, but still really amazing. Um, it sort of reminded me. There's like uh, plenty of viral videos that have gone around on Facebook, like crazy chocolate um, things, and basically they it's it's called a chocolate dome, and they pour like this hot. Um, I think it's, it's like caramel a caramel sauce, sauce that they yeah. pour over it. And, Sophie um, probably knows. Sophie, what do they do? <laughs> <laughs> it's, like, it's, like, it's like a reverse volcano. So yeah, lava yes, obviously right. usually comes out of a volcano, but this you pour it over and it implodes on itself. Totally yeah. melts. Yeah. Yeah. It's all this like new and like, delicious treats. Um, this amazing brownie. The brownie mm. is actually so good, and um, on top of it was like a. It looks like a special effect. Like when it's you you right. videoed it and you showed us, it looks like special effects. So how did it taste though? Oh, so so good. The fact that you want to video your dessert, I mean, it's obviously pretty impressive. <laughs> and, and let's be honest, you need something to blast a fish flavour out of your mouth. Oh. And chocolate will do that. Now you can check out all the delicious pics on at Crave Newcastle on Instagram. Jess and Mel, thanks for popping in. Thank you very much, guys. Four days to go. Till JB is on our world famous rooftop after nine o'clock, I'm going to give you the chance.